What percentage of people that have concussions typically have B BVD? So I believe research shows that at least 75% of people with concussions have binocular vision dysfunction. And when you learn about binocular vision, there's so many components to it. But doctors typically evaluate one out of the like 17 components that you would need for these for the vision to function perfectly. So 75% of people with concussion can exhibit these binocular vision dysfunction symptoms. And it all has to do with the brain. 70% of the brain is responsible for processing your vision, the sensory and the motor component of it. And then you have six cranial nerves that are controlling your eye movements and your eye muscles and your focusing. And then you have 12 extraocular muscles and two intrinsic muscles that are controlling your eye movements, your focusing function, depth, etc. So if only one of those components goes off, you have a problem. You have a binocular vision dysfunction. Now the brain, the muscles, the nervous system has to constantly try to figure out how to deal with this issue. So it creates these compensatory mechanisms like head tilt, like a body tilt, and like eyebrows wrinkling and frowning, all kinds of weird type of mechanism that the brain comes up with to deal with these issues. If I see a patient and they say, I've had a concussion, I know the first thing I'm looking into is binocular vision dysfunction.